I think uh, as the IG confirmed and the ESCC, uh, there were no such elite squads. And I think I've, we've also, or I'll also ask you guys to give us the photos of those so-called elite squads who are there. Uh, there was no such squad, there was no ESCC, nor are there any uh, DCI or NPS officials mm -hmm. or officers. I think if there are such allegations, that uh, then I would advise uh, uh, those who are making those allegations to go and report to the nearest police station for investigations to commence. Otherwise, uh, as far as we are concerned, there was no such uh, incidents that occurred. Mm -hmm. Do you have any active investigation or consideration of prosecuting former cabinet secretary Fred Matani in the matter? <laughs> I think you know. For a long time, it's the media that has been even asking about the Ruaraka land issue. Uh, and uh, once the file is ready, I think we will make the, the decision uh, and we will inform the public what the decision will be. Uh, we are awaiting uh, finalization of the financial uh, investigations. Once that is ready, then we will make the appropriate uh, decisions. Um, in relation to other investigations, um, I think that question will have to be posed to the investigating uh, authorities. Mm -hmm. uh, and in any case, no one is above the law, and anyone can be investigated. To, to be specific on that Roraka land matter, because the information I have is that there's a, there's a possibility that a file came from the SEC to your office. Have you been able to make a decision and send it back or... If, if you know very well if we uh, have made decisions that we will make it public. Mm -hmm. There's nothing to hide about it. And when the time comes, we shall do that. So you haven't, you haven't made a decision on who to charge and how to do it? As I say, if we had, you would be one of the first people to know, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So you cannot take rumors and innuendos outside there to be the truth. Uh, and we have to be very careful, and, uh, you know, uh, not, not, not to mislead uh, the public. Right. Then we've heard from one of the former cabinet secretaries making a uh, claim that uh, there are actually several uh, former officials going to the cabinet secretaries and principal secretaries that are also being pursued. Is there any information that you'd be aware of, of matters that are being investigated in relation to cabinet secretaries or principal secretaries other than Fred Matei? Um, I think, again, you know the way we operate as ODPP. If there are investigations or the files have come to us, especially if the files have come to us, then we share that information. We are an institution that believes in openness and in making sure that the public understands what we're doing. And we are not afraid of doing that. So if there is, then uh, we will share. Uh, but I take exception to the fact that, uh, that it is an issue if any of those uh, are going to be investigated. It should not be an issue. Uh, no one is above the law. Anyone can be investigated. So you're not aware of any active investigation or maybe a file that has come to you? No, there's no file. That's what I'm telling you. Okay. 